flash drive that we're going to have uh, when you go register at the Red Knot Inn. We're going to have a table with some things uh, that you can look at and it's for sale. And we have a thumb drive with about 100 pictures on it from this week. So, um, you know, stop in and check. Anne's going to be learning that. And um, uh, like I said, we had a lot of fun. You can see that in the photograph. So I'd like to now turn the program over to the camp director. Responsibility is trying to make the camp run, and along with uh, adding in and making sure the curriculum is going the way we want. And one of the things that we did this year is we made this brain stretching fun, and at the same time, we get as close as cutting edge as we could. We've incorporated two programs that we've successfully so far have been very becoming a main uh, a main staple in our curriculum. One of those is the drone program, led by uh, two our two our counselors that were trained by SRS. And also we incorporated the um, Arduino, which is an introduction to coding. So some of the some of the features where you guys uh, saw the kids on the computers, that was them working on Arduino and doing some basic coding. Um, so that's one of the things that we did. Now, of course, I could not do this without my crew. And here goes, here comes the Navy part of it coming out. Um, and I would like to introduce you to my crew that helped uh, make this program run, starting with our rock crew guy, Jeff, um, I'm sorry, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Steve. Sometimes I mess with him calling him Esteban. Okay. Good. I'm Steve. I'm Hi, Steve. I'm Hi, Steve. I'm a rock program. I'm a aerospace engineering major, junior at Virginia Tech. Um, <laughs> Hi everybody, my name is Maddie Wyatt. Uh, I just finished up my first year at Olin College studying mechanical engineering. Love it, it's awesome. And uh, I work with your kids and do a lot of robotics. Of how they got positions in NASA. That's what we've always encouraged. 
Now, the last piece of this is going to be, we're going to do some awards. Uh, every camp, we always recognize campers in uh, three of our major disciplines. Hopefully, we'll start bringing on five more, uh, two more with the uh, Arduino and the um, drones. Um, but we want to recognize campers in the mission patch, robotics, and rocketry. Okay. Now, every camp, at the beginning of every camp, we always give this first challenge to our campers, which is called the mission patch challenge. And what it does is it sort of mimics what the NASA astronaut did every time when they went on a mission. They've always created some kind of patch to commemorate what, they, what their mission is about. And what it does is it helps them to start thinking and focusing on what it is that they want to accomplish at camp. So the campers were put in groups, and then they got submitted then their uh, um, mission patch for the week, and then everybody got to vote on which one that they felt or, res or had a mission patch that resonated with them. And the, the winning uh, mission patch, if you could help uh, recognize these individuals, uh, can you please have Ivan? Lucas and Beckett come up 